All right, guys, we got a location change yet again. This uh, this Advent video series is turning out to be kind of a pain in the butt. <laughs> Every time I go to shoot in my office, there's some class happening or the schedule's so late it's the end of the day and I can't get good lighting, but I'm in what used to be my office and is now the new vault, standing at the bar, which you guys have seen on camera. And today we are doing Wild Turkey 101. Now, I'm excited about this one because in my brain, just damn classic bourbon, hard to get wrong. Reached out to Wild Turkey, didn't hear anything about Rhett's or anything, so there's no Rhett to talk about. Although, um, they did forward my email over to Matthew McConaughey, who's going to be joining me for... No, it's not happening. <laughs> Probably because I didn't drink Long Branch. Oh well, what are you gonna do? All right, all right, all right. Okay, now, let's hit wild turkey. Typical on the nose. That really fruity, dark cherry chocolate mixed with that dust and corn and grass note. And there's a little bit of a mustiness to it that I kind of dig. It's not a struggle, even though it's 101. But it's not overly candied either. Mmm. Yeah, see, this has just got all the good... Classic... Slight barrel tannin, but not so much it dries your mouth out. Nice cherry, but not so much that it's true candy. It just floats right down the middle. Enough alcohol that it feels like it's got oomph and it's not boring. Yeah, it's just, it's perfect classic American bourbon. So, Musically, because it's not got a ton of lows, but it's deep, rich on the mids, but it's not uh, turned up and honky, and it's it's got character, but it's not overly sharp and brittle. I'm going to call this one... <laughs> I'm going to call this one Johnny Cash. I'm going to say uh, newer albums, where there's a little bit more in-depth production... Uh, but still, it's just still Johnny Cash, right? It's still that voice and that classic kind of way he played guitar and the simple classic rhythms that somehow Johnny Cash always took standards that were almost trite and cliche. But when Johnny Cash sang them, they weren't cliche anymore. Uh, they just felt right. You know, and like someone else could play a Johnny Cash style song and you'd think oh you're doing old school boring doom ding a doom ding a doom ding a doom and it's uh it's too predictable but then johnny cash does it and you're like oh it feels like home so wild turkey 101 johnny cash man i'll tell you the first time and i've always listened to johnny cash uh uh here and there you sort of grow up around it when you're in the south but I felt, I, I remember the first time I truly understood what he could do was way late in his career. And then I went back and rediscovered him, uh, was when he did that cover of Hurt, the, you know, Nine Inch Nails song. And holy crap, if you haven't seen that, go watch it. Um, and then there's this bar in Austin called the Mean Eyed Cat, and it's a Johnny Cash bar. And even though it's in its second generation and it's a little more developed and originally it was a bar built in an old chainsaw repair shop and uh, next to the railroad tracks. And it's still one of my places I really love to go hang out at late at night on a weeknight when no one else is there. And I used to go there because uh, they're open until two. I used to go there when they only served beer and no hard liquor after a show and I'd grab a beer and all they had on the jukebox was Johnny Cash tunes. 
and people who covered Johnny Cash. And so I'd go over there and just, and I, I, that's really, so 2009, 2010 is when I really started rediscovering early Johnny Cash and falling back in love. But uh, it's hard to mess that up. <sighs> yep. That's a good one. I like keeping these videos to five, six minutes, so they're little short nuggets in the middle of the day. Remember that this is a list curated by the Whiskey Tribe people and the Facebook group, and then we organized it, and then we're delivering it sort of secretly right now. And by secret, I mean we're not publishing it, but uh, anywhere except the Whiskey Tribe website, and then we're putting the links. Once this whole thing is done, we will retroactively uh, make those a part of a playlist on YouTube so you can see them. But we're kind of keeping this an inside group thing um, for now. But rock and roll. Uh, until tomorrow, may your crazy say this side illegal, and may you return before we have time to miss you. Cheers.